Good afternoon, ladies and gents. So I bought a book, book today. And, um, yeah, me and David went shopping for groceries. And I got this book. It's a Daily Devotional Prayers of Peace, Joy, and Hope. Yep. Jesus Listens by this lady named Sarah Young. Let's see. How am I going to do this without this light here? Let's see. Will that stay there? I think that'll stay there. Okay, everyone. So, my brother-in-law talking in the background, as always. He knows when I'm going to do video. But, um, so look. Experience a delightful relationship with the Savior who loves to hear your prayers. Did you know that Jesus loves to hear when we talk to him? When we share with him what's on our hearts, in our minds, what we're thinking, daily he wants to hear from us. He already knows, but he wants us to want him so I bought this book. Both David and I seen it at the same time. And David actually walked up to it because of the cross and what it said. Jesus listens. So let's see. What's today? Today is Tuesday, July 19th. So let's go to Tuesday, July 19th. Just out of curiosity to see what it says for today. Tuesday, July 19th, out of this book, Ever-Present God. Yeah, God is very present, especially when you welcome him into your life, your everyday being, your everyday whatever you're doing. If you welcome Christ Jesus into your life, he will most definitely dwell there. So July 19th, Ever-Present God. This is a time in my life when I must learn to let go of loved ones, of possessions, of control. To let go of things that are precious to me, I need to rest in your presence where I am complete. As I take time to bask in the light of your love, I'm able to relax more fully. Then my grasping hand gradually opens up releasing my prized possession into your care. You have been teaching me that it's possible to feel secure even in the midst of the most difficult, painful circumstances through staying aware of your continual presence with me. I rejoice that you are always with me and you will never change. You are the same yesterday, today, and forever. As I release more and more things into your care, I'm blessed by your assurance that you never let go of my hand. I love to hear you speaking to me through your word. I am the Lord your God who takes hold of your right hand and says to you, do not fear. I will help you. Thank you for being my firm, secure foundation that no one and no circumstance can take away from me. In your steadfast love and name, Jesus, amen. And then it gives scriptures, Psalms 89, 15, Hebrews 13, 8, out of the New King James Version Bible, and Isaiah 41 13. So there you have it, folks, for July 19th. Isn't it awesome that we know that Christ Jesus is holding our hand throughout life? He's actually with us. He's our our daddy, like, you know, like a little child. Picture a little child walking with his father, holding his hand, just strolling along through life with the confidence that his daddy is going to take care of him and protect him. Well, Christ Jesus, God, the Holy Spirit, here to protect us all and to guide us throughout life 
and to love us and to bless us and to cherish us. So I love you. I just got in. I was out for a little bit and I thought, you know what? I want to read out of my new book that I bought and I want to share today's devotional with my viewers. So that's it. I do not own the copyrights of this book or anything that was written. Sarah Young is the author of Jesus Calling. Love you guys. Have a beautiful uh, day. And both David and I go back to work tomorrow. So I get up at 1.32 o'clock in the morning. So I will be calling it a day at 6 p.m. today. Around 6, 6.30, 7 o'clock today. And it's only because I've been off for two days. So I can stay up till 7. No later than that, though. Love you guys. Bye. Now be patient because I have to download this video. And then it has to process. And then I'll share it with you all. Bye-bye.